Hi, and welcome to Low Carb Cocktails. I'm your host, Frank. And just because you've chosen a low carb lifestyle doesn't mean you can't enjoy a great cocktail. And that's why I'm here to teach you how to take your favorite cocktail and cocktails in general and enjoy them low carb. Let's get started. Tonight, we'll be making a cocktail that I came up with after a night of binge playing of World of Warcraft called the OOM Mana Juice. So for those who don't know about World of Warcraft, OOM stands for Out of Mana. So, and that's kind of what you yell when you want somebody to stop playing, so for a few minutes so you can drink a potion, blah, blah, blah. Lots of nerd talk going on here. So let's kind of skip some of the nerd talk and let's get into the cocktail. That's what this is all about. So the OOM Hila Juice is all of these ingredients. Rum, once again, Louisiana rum. Uh, vodka, our homemade low-carb blue curacao substitute. Lots of words in that one. Um, and concentrated lemon juice. We are using this because we're trying to keep our carbs down. And the blue curacao that I've made has two and a half grams of carbs per ounce. So kind of want to keep it under, right about there if I can. By using fresh lime juice, it's going to bring it up to about four and a half grams of carbs, which really isn't bad. It stays underneath my five grams of carbs cocktails. I'll cut it back a little bit and make this cocktail just two and a half grams of carbs just for the blue curacao. So let's go ahead and get this started. First thing we're going to do is we're going to take our rum. Today I'm going to be using Kicking Mule Rum. Man, I tried this straight yesterday. Um, just tasting it. Oh, it's so delicious. Um, a really strong vanilla taste to it. Um, oh, wow, it's like candy. It, it's just so delicious. So um, if you find us around where you live, go ahead and pick up some Kicking Mule. Once again, Louisiana rums. Some Deep Eddie's Vodka, because that's all I have. Our homemade blue curacao substitute. I don't want to call it blue curacao because it's not truly blue curacao. It's an orange liqueur that dyed blue. So that's it. So our homemade triple sec recipe right here. A little blue food coloring. There you go. That's it. And our concentrated lemon juice. You could use fresh. It's going to taste a little bit better by using fresh. But we're going to use bottled just to keep the carbs down. And that's it. So. We're going to go with two ounces of the rum. We're going to go with one ounce of the vodka. One ounce of the blue curacao. One ounce of the lemon juice. And the last ingredient, one ounce of Splenda Serum. That's it. So let's go ahead and get some ice in here and get this shaken up. Also, I've had a tall Collins glass with some ice already in it, chilling. Now let's put some ice in here. If you're serving to friends, you might not want to grab it with your hands. So if it's just you, hey, do you really care if you grab it with your hands? You know what it's been. And if so, if you do care, it should have been washed before you started. And cap that off. And just give this a good shake. Shake about 10 seconds or so, just to get the uh, to get that frost built up on the side of your tin, um, so it's a little bit cold to hold. Grab your Hawthorne strainer, put it on top. And there you have it. A little lime wedge on top of it. Why not? Let's make this pretty. Take my sticker off. Because who wants a sticker in their garnish? I'm going to go ahead and garnish this with a lemon zest and a cherry. Let's see if I don't mess this up. I'm getting a little bit better with it. Not bad, not bad. Getting a little bit better with the garnish and the zesting. a bing cherry. If you watch one of my other videos about bing cherries, I'm going to have about a little less than a gram of carbs per cherry. And I guess it's a little bit short, but hey, there you go. And there you have it, your OOM healer juice. Mmm. Oh man, 
I remember why I made that now. That's delicious. Now, any of my Warcraft players out there, call her mana potions. And yes, I'm geeking out on this right now. So, um, that's delicious. Yeah, there's that um, little vanilla notes I was mentioning about from that kicking mule rum. A little sweetness. Um, I said that's almost like a vanilla taffy kind of sorta. It's got that flavor. Um, that extra shot of the vodka really brings that alcohol content up. It makes it a little bit strong. And that orange from the blue curacao. A little bit of sour from the lemon juice. Um, damn tasty cocktail. You get two and a half grams of carbs. That's a pretty cocktail. And uh, still probably got a half a, half a cocktail left. So once I take a little bit out of this, I'll be topping that off. And uh, maybe hitting a little bit of Warcraft tonight, guys. So there you have it, my first low-carb nerd cocktail, the World of Warcraft OOM Healer Juice. Y'all have a good night. I know I am. Mm. See y'all later.